BMC Amy Capacity reporting 24.3 comes with new exciting features. Start with creating a standalone dashboard site for offline analysis. Use the new Getting Started workflow templates for better insights. Use the new dynamic time selection options for the billing months. View dashboard export logs and schedule daily export of the event logs. You can also check the server process status from the main menu. In this version, we are introducing the option to export dashboards and create a standalone dashboard site directly on your device. No back-end web server is required. Use these dashboards to view the historical charts of your data at your convenience. Maintain confidentiality when sharing standalone dashboards with your customers. You control which customers see the exported dashboards and workflows. You can test the validity of the target path before exporting the dashboards and then set a target path for all the selected dashboards in one go. You can also revoke the export request at any time. To export a dashboard, on the main page, click Export Dashboard. Select one or more dashboards for export from the Daily Dashboard window. Enter a target path to export the dashboard. To verify the target location click Test. Or, you can click Set Folder for Dashboards to set the target path for all the dashboards at one go. Then click Export Dashboards to create your standalone dashboard site. You can use the Server Process Status feature to check whether the dashboards were exported successfully. We have added new Getting Started workflow templates to quickly detect anomalies and ensure peak server uptime for seamless operations. The Getting Started CICS Transactional Applications Workflow Template detects the anomalies in the transaction rates and response time for the most active CICS applications and regions. The Getting Started MSU by WLM Importance Workflow Template detects the anomalies in MSU consumption by each WLM Goal Importance Level for the two most active sysplexes. The Getting Started Coupling Facility Performance Workflow Template detects the anomalies in CF KPIs such as CPU utilization, free storage, and path contention. The Getting Started XCF Performance Workflow Template detects anomalies in XCF KPIs for the most active ZOS image, such as total traffic, path contention, and buffer allocation issues. BMC Amy Capacity reporting 24.3 comes with two new dynamic time selection options. The last end billing months option compares usage performance over end billing cycles for increasing or decreasing usage. The last end billing today of the month option compares the partial usage over end billing cycles for increasing or decreasing usage. The application log viewer now includes dashboard export logs tab and the dashboard export event logs tab to view and schedule daily export of the event logs. The dashboard export logs tab displays the export summary at different time intervals. The Dashboard Export Event Logs display the events that occurred at a particular instance. This release also includes an option to check the server process status for the Dashboard Export and Nightly process. The Server Process Status feature displays the statuses of the server processes in use, the last status of the server process, the latest time and date when the server process was last run, and provides the option to run the server process for one or more dashboards. Upgrade today to explore the exciting new features of BMC Amy Capacity reporting 24.3. Thank you for watching.